We already know that we have a lot of talented and athletic individuals running and cycling around St. Louis, but now we're home of two new world records, all because of our next guest. For those of you who are into the cycling world, you know her. She's also a partner at Goldenberg Heller and Antognoli Law Firm. Did I say that right, Antognoli? <laughs> you did. Is that pretty close anyway? Very close. They're not going to sue me, are they? Because they're really good at it over there. <laughs> I want you to welcome Elizabeth Liz Heller to Great Day St. Louis. World record holder. Hey! <laughs> We're so Thank glad you. Congrats. There. Tell us about breaking two world records. I traveled to... Agua Calientes, Mexico, at uh, the beginning of April, and, and broke the uh, women's master's two-kilometer pursuit world record, and I also did the hour, and I was able to break that record as well. That is so awesome. Did you have any clue that you had a shot at a world record when you went out there? Oh, yeah. It's a, it's, it's a long trip. Um, uh, I absolutely hoped I could. Mm -hmm. um, I was a little less convinced I could break the hour, I, I thought I could break the pursuit record. The pursuit is only two, uh, eight laps, mm -hmm. uh, a little over a mile and a half, mm -hmm. um, and I busted that one. Uh, the hour record is something I've never done before. Um, kind of a unique event, simply you and the t clock, and mm -hmm. you're out there for an hour, and you go as, as long and uh, as fast as you can. Liz went down there on a mission for sure. When did you start cycling? Uh, well, without dating myself, I, I started <laughs> riding. I, I graduated uh, uh, after playing basketball. I started cycling in triathlons at the beginning of that. So we're talking early 80s, and I've been riding uh, for a good 35 years. Uh, it, it's been a while. <laughs> and has, it, has it always been, Liz, about competition, or was this as a fitness thing, or, or were you an enthusiast, or was it always about the competition for you? Um, I love to compete. That's why I think yeah. I do it. I also, uh, it's an escape for me when I'm on my bike and uh, mm -hmm. racing. I don't think about the office. I don't think about much anything except what's right, right in front of sure. me. So it's, it's, uh, uh, it's mostly the competition. I'm, I, I just love to compete, whether it's... Uh, the boys out on Clayton Road or, um, you know, in events like this, um, sure. it's special for me. Where do you plan to compete next? What's, what's coming up? <laughs> um, I'm going to switch gears in a big way, um, and I am going to race in a gravel race in Kansas. It's called the Dirty Kansa. Wow. Um, it's 100 miles. Um, Ooh, wow. And... Uh, I won't go any as fast, but it's, I, I hope, you know, I think I could surprise some people. I'm an, uh, you know, I, I, I'd like to finish in the top 10 among women, um, and, and uh, we'll see, but I, I'm I looking feeling, forward to it. I have a feeling you're going to surprise some people. <laughs> Liz, congratulations, and thanks for taking time to visit with us. It's Thank awesome. you. We appreciate having you in studio, and uh, that's great. It's pretty Very awesome. Exciting. It's inspiring, right? Very inspiring. Makes me want to go, nah, never mind.